Closing polylines with the fillet command. Here I have two different polylines. They're not connected and they're not parallel. And we can use the fillet command to make these two polylines connect at the implied intersection here. So we're just going to go up and we're going to use fillet command and we're going to set the radius to whatever we want. We can set the zero or set some value just so it's very visible. I'll set the one and then I pick on one of the lines and I pick on the other line and it connects the two. It makes it into one continuous polyline, joins them together with whatever, whatever specified value that you had. Like I said, it could be zero if you want, but it closes polylines together and joins them together for you. So we all we had to have was two polylines that were non-parallel and non-intersecting.